Hey guys, D3 Roach here from Rad Roaches. Um, I'm just bringing you a quick tutorial today. Um, uh, several of you guys were asking about how to transfer worlds from creative to survival or how to save worlds or stuff like that. So I'm just going to bring you this really quick tutorial. First thing you're going to want is iExplorer right here. And uh, what you're just going to do is go ahead and connect your device. Now, as far as I know, this is how you do it on iOS. I'm not sure about Android at all. And sorry for my appearance. I just woke up. Um, but just go ahead and connect your device and then open up iExplorer. Uh, give me a second here. And then the next thing you're going to want to do after that is open, you're going to go ahead and skip this quick ad that pops up. Um, and then you're going to want to locate the Minecraft Pocket Edition app, which is right here, com.mojang.minecraft.pe. You're going to go ahead and go to your Documents folder, Games, com.mojang, Minecraft Worlds, and this will display all your worlds. Now, as you see here, I've already basically created one. So you're just going to... I'm just going to go ahead and delete all these files right here. Alright, so let's say I want to use my creative world. So this is my creative world right here. I'm going to delete the chunks.dat. Now I'm going to go here to the vanilla server. And I'm going to copy, and, or I'm going to drag the chunks.dat from my survival, which is vanilla. And then I'm going to drag it here onto my desktop. Then I'm going to go back to the, um, back to my creative world, which is this roach one. And for some reason this is being a little laggy right now. Alright, so once that's, I'm back to this level right here, I'm going to just drag this back in. And this will do its little refresh thing and loading bar and all that. And there you go. So once that's done, basically you're just going to close. You're going to come onto your device here. Oh, stupid little thing. Um, give me a second. Alright, so you're just going to come back onto your device. You're going to make sure you end all the processes, well, not all the processes, you're just going to want to make sure you end Minecraft Pocket Edition. So we'll go ahead and uh, open the app up. We're going to go ahead and start our world. And we're going to head and go to Creative, which is the Roach. Give it a second, it's got to load up. And we'll go ahead and fly over. And boom. As you see, this is a cobblestone house I built in my survival server, or in my survival world. Um, and then we'll fly over over here as you see there's my giant obsidian obelisk from when I was doing the uh, tutorial on how to build the nether reactor um, so basically it's great if you want to start out and build a custom world just before you begin all you do is create one survival world and one creative world then uh, just build your house, whatever, plant down resources, just build your custom map to your liking. And then this is great for if you want to transfer it to your survival world. Um, it's basically the exact same way if you guys want to save your worlds. You'll just go back to your iExplorer. I don't know why I closed that. And as you guys see here, I've already pre-done it. Um, and this is also a great way to get rid of the obsidian from those giant stone obelisks. So as you see, I've already saved the vanilla world out here, but I'll just go ahead and show you with my other world. So we'll go back to mojang.minecraft.pe, documents, 
games, Comdot Mojang, Minecraft Worlds. And then we'll go ahead and drag the Roach folder out. And that's basically all there is to it. It's that's all you have to do. Um, so again, you need I Explorer, and that's basically it. You're basically done from that. It's just really simple to do, really fast, really easy. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Rate, comment, subscribe. You know, you don't have to. It's just whatever. Um, but it'd be nice considering I'm just trying to help you out. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.